Hey everyone, it's Allison here. So I have a few models to show you, and then um, I have a few pencil cases and some bracelets as well. So first up, I want to show you a wallet that I'm really excited about. It's based off of a duct tape Snivets wallet, and it's for XX. Do not click this XX. So um, here's your wallet. This is the back, and then this is the front. It looks like this. I think it looks really nice. Um, I don't have the design on it yet. He wants a Nest controller design, so I'm going to be putting that on later, but I want to get the basics of your wallet done. It's gray on, in the billfold, and then on the inside, it has um, an ID slot right here. So it looks like this. And then... It has a hidden pocket right here, and then it has two card pockets, and the top one does fit cards very easily. And then when you flip this over, it has a really nice design, a black, gray, and red, which are kind of like the basic colors, yeah. And then you have another hidden pocket right here, and then again you have two hidden pockets, I mean two pockets, and they're really large. And then you can pull this one out and you can put it over like this. So it looks like this. And you have three pockets. So one, two, three. And they all fit cards really nicely. And as you can see, no cards show over. Um, and then again, when you flip it over, you have that nice design. So you can also, if you don't want this piece in, then you can use it with it out. So it'll look like this, and it's really nice and thin. So it looks really nice. Or if you don't want to have any, if you don't have any change on you, you just want to bring like your card or something, then you can just keep this wallet with you. And this one's like super thin because it's pretty much like nothing. <laughs> but yeah, because this doesn't have a bill fold on it. But I think it looks really cool, and it folds easiest when you have the card, when you have the ID out. But um, once I, I'll probably like just press this part, this part, because um, it's being a little reluctant to fold right now. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you like your wallet. Um, next up for two crafty girls, I made your wallet, and so I hope you really like it. It's a multicolored polka dot with multicolored polka dot inside. And then I did do the specific design that you wanted. So you asked for three pockets and it's lined in black, a hidden pocket, and it does fold evenly. And this is the, this would be the front of your wallet. So I think it looks really nice, trying to get that glare out. <clears throat> and then you asked for another hidden pocket, which again, folds evenly and you have your ID slot and then you have the pocket up top so I hope you really like your wallet um, I think it looks really good and here's the full outside so it looks really nice um, next up for Fabian I think that's how you say your username uh, I made this wallet for you, and you said your favorite colors were white, black, and red. So I hope you like the design. I did really small uh, woven uh, like pieces of duct tape, and, and I think it always looks really good when it turns out like this. Um, the inside, I kind of I've done this design before on a different wallet, and I really like the way it turned out. So I hope you like it on this wallet. This is clear taped over, as so you can kind of see the glossiness. So nothing's going to get stuck. And then on this side, it's black on the billfold. Then on the inside of your wallet, you have my new basic design, which is just three pockets. And I did the pockets white and the trim red. Um, a hidden pocket, and it does fold really nicely. And it's actually thin, surprisingly. And then you have your ID slot from the top. So, um, typically I'm really bad at making woven wallets, but this one's actually pretty thin. As you can see, it's a lot uh, thinner than my old ones used to be. So I think this looks really awesome, so I really hope you like it. Next up for... I suck it in your envelope. 
for the uh, Taylor Long, which that's her username, or Diana, I think that's her real name. Um, you wanted this bracelet, and I still have to make your other wallets. So it's um, uh, light blue, green, and purple. And it looks really nice with purple magnets. Um, next up, for Hannah R., we have the multicolored polka dot uh, mini wallet. Just wide on the inside, and it does fold evenly. And then you have your. You asked for. Get my card. You asked for three pockets. So one, two, three. An ID, and then behind the ID, it is multicolored polka dot. My business card always gets stuck, but um, cards don't get stuck because they're a lot smaller. Wow. Of course, I'll put it in uneven. But yeah, as you can see, it goes in and out very easily. And then um, you ask for a coin pouch. And underneath it, the inside of the coin pouch is all white. So, um, yeah. My ID is like really long for some reason. So, um, okay. So, next for Desiree, we have this. Um, oh, it always gets stuck right here. I hate it when that happens. Okay. So, I guess that's if I open it all the way. <laughs> it's a multicolored polka dot pencil case. And I think it looks really nice. And so that's for you. And you do have a bracelet that goes along with it. And then next up for Brianna Cantwell, uh, there is this wallet. Three pockets and an ID. I've already shown the wallet. It's super thin, folds really nicely. And then you have your mini wallet, which I've already shown as well. Looks really nice. And it has three pockets and an ID. And then we have this bracelet. It helps if I put my hand behind it. Um, blue, uh, light blue, white, and green. I think looks really nice. I already showed this. This is the one I made a tutorial on. And your pencil case, which is skulls and crossbone. Black on the inside. And it has a black zipper. And I tried lining it up the best I could, like right here and stuff. It's lined up right there. So I hope it looks okay. So I really hope you guys like your wallets. And um, I have a squishy video coming out tonight as well. And yeah, so that's basically it. Bye.